Broadway.com is Broadway.com. Hey, Broadway.com. <laughs> How meta is this? Ridiculous. So we're, <laughs> we're, being, we're at our cast recording. Yay! <laughs> I'm sorry I'm doing the vlog. Too bright. <laughs> it's a little bright. <laughs> and uh, uh, you guys can't hear, but Zach's talking in my head, so it's really hard for me to <laughs> talk right now. Um, we are filming, we're filming um, for... Broadway.com is recording us doing our cast recording, and I'm recording Broadway.com, recording Broadway.com. Isn't that crazy? Say hi, Sam. Hey, how's it going? You ready to be beautiful? Uh, well, you know, no one's really ever ready for that. Um, so this is our recording studio. It's very exciting. Um, Zach and I just got here, and we're going to sing first impressions. Zach, can, is there a zoom on this thing? Yeah, up at the top. Up at the top? Yeah, uh, this little thing. Oh, here. yeah, right there. Zach, say hi. So that's Zach. He's recording. He's <laughs> being a little bashful right now. <laughs> um, this is our glorious studio. We just finished recording First Impressions, and now Zach is going to do... <laughs> he's hiding from me. He's going to do um, Allison's theme, which I'll shoot from the control room so you guys can see everything. Just wave. Oh, look it. He's a little shy today. <laughs> so now we're in the control room. The the like very serious control room and you you guys have met Alan and Michael our writers uh, that's Dominic our vocal director who is at the helm and Derek who's our engineer today um, before we sing, I would like you to do to a few passes through your line guess he can't help himself Gabe I'm simply too wonderful just let me know guess he can't help himself Gabe I'm simply too wonderful. Guess he can't help himself, Gabe. I'm simply too wonderful. Can she delight and I'm can you, too wonderful? Can you uh, be a little sweeter and more delighted uh, on a <laughs> too wonderful? Sure. A little more Disney princess? <laughs> yes. They like that. Guess he can't help himself, Gabe. I'm simply too wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> can Kate Lopress take direction or what? <laughs> to watch and listen to her sing it. You look buff, you've been working out, babe. All your hotness is making me weak. Love the haircut, I love the suit. You're a walking example of chic. You're the handsomest man in this restaurant. Like a model right out of GQ. You are also the world's greatest lover. Then it cuts out. You don't know what she's gonna say. <laughs> this is the. I loved those guys. Weird warm up that Zach's decided to do. Five foot four with a cream complexion. He's all eyes you'll be lost in four days. Chestnut hair halfway down the back. Slender figure with breasts that amaze Just the slightest hint of a dimple Pony lips with a lily white smile Tiny birth mark below the right shoulder And a manic, depressive, demanding, emasculating <laughs> Michael just got married um, See, isn't that fancy? To um, Broadway actress Wendy Bergamini and um, we very beautiful. A nice wedding during yes, tech. during tech, he left the show to go get married. And the show um, still went fine. Everything, everything happened. Every, nothing fell apart. Um, all of our writers, uh, Michael and um, Austin and Alan, wrote the show because of their dating um, mishaps, and now they're all married to gorgeous, beautiful, lovely, sweet women. I don't know so, why they chose us. I, I, don't, I, I don't know why. There's some good juju going on in our show. So all of the rest of us are hoping it rubs off on us. My teacher from college sent me, uh, when I was in college, I, I listed all my dream roles. It was two pages. And um, the last two were um, to originate a role in a musical, in a new musical. And then the second one was to originate a role in a hit musical. <laughs> At 19, I made that distinction. <laughs> I was like, "Yeah, I'll do the one, and then I'll do the other." But um, so I what think was, I think maybe uh, I think maybe first aid is the uh, 
It hits both. You're gonna do it both. Although I did originate in Adam's family, so. Okay, so here I am. I'm about to record my solo called Safer. Um, yeah, I've been here for a couple hours. Haven't really done a lot of stuff. Recorded first impressions, which you saw a little bit of. And um, now here we go. So I'm gonna let you see some of it, even though it's raw footage, uh, if I can, if I can get it on there. So enjoy. I know that I have issues. I face them, I swear. Think I overcome them, then turn, they're still there. Wish that I was different, I'd like to let go. But when I try to change, there's my past saying no. Maybe it's all cause of dad, his new kids, his new wife. Or why not just blame mom, who's been nuts my whole life. When you felt so alone since the moment of birth, and you've struggled to find your own true sense of worth. When it seems there is no one across this whole earth to depend upon, you carry on. Just like you always do. Cause it's safer to rely on you. Oh, it's safer to rely on you. Um, and we are now at Sarah Chase's dressing room, and we're going to talk to her about her Broadway debut. Hi! Hi! <laughs> Here we are in Sarah Chase's beautiful dressing room. So this is Sarah Chase. She plays Grandma Ida. She plays Lauren, my sister, which is my favorite part. And um, you play lots of things. Lots of things. You play Zach's mom. Zach's mom. And... Awkward pause lady. Awkward pause lady. So we have some Twitter questions what? for you. <laughs> and I have some questions of myself. So Sarah's making her Broadway debut, which is really exciting. Not that she hasn't had the opportunity before. Oh. She's had many opportunities, but she decided to choose us, which yes. is really exciting. And we're very happy that she's here. Um, so my, I have a question for you. My yeah. first question. Tell me, like, one thing that is better about Broadway than you expected, and one thing that is different about, like, something that you didn't expect about being on Broadway. Okay. Um, well, this is definitely, this is one of those experiences that exceeds your expectations. Totally. Like, you, I dreamed about being on Broadway since, you know, we knew what it was, and this is so much better, and I think the way that we're doing it is so cool. I mean, yeah. It's, it's, there's a photo of each of us outside the theater. There's so seven great. of us. We get so much attention. You get your own dressing room. Own dressing that room. That never happens. <laughs> I, uh, I wouldn't know that. Um, you get. We did the cast recording last week. Uh -huh. Like this is. I, They're I gonna see that in this episode. Oh really? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I found it. Uh, I and thank God I didn't wear the same top. I thought about that. Um, when I woke up 40 minutes ago. I uh, yeah no I can't imagine any better way of doing this and yeah. then on top of that everyone's so 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 nice yeah like super they're like nice. super sick of hearing us it's like just I bomb know, love it's all over everyone it's we true. love each other and i think the thing that i wasn't expecting was like as grateful 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 as i am and i am it's hard to remember when you're so exhausted like yeah. to like stay grateful or what okay i mean because i we are yeah. and i am but like i forgot how taxing musical theater can be oh my god yeah. i know especially when you don't leave stage for yeah the whole time it's like you and i like we took like a like a hiatus yeah and then came back and ran a marathon exactly. without warming up exactly like, that's how it feels that was well said sometimes yes. Yes. Yes, yes, yes um yeah i know if you and sarah chase were sisters in real life do you think you would get along yeah, yeah, I think so. I think we're very similar, like in that yeah. we no BS, no like, yeah. We're, we get yeah. we get through some tough times, like yeah, we yeah. do in the show. Yeah, but and we're gonna have spa day soon. We have like, spa day coming up. Yeah, we're I gonna am. have like puppy holding day. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we have similar interests. Although I am not getting in a sauna next to you. I would look like um, <laughs> the same like, puff marshmallow man. I'm like, we're going to do, do a spa day. She's like, do I have to wear a bathing suit? Do I have to no, stand next to it? Because I'm fat and have back knees, so it's, I'm not getting in a sauna a next to this one. This one's a hot. Uh, true. Okay, we're moving on. Um, what's it like having to be multiple characters during one performance? Um, it's, uh, it's This has to be kind of easy for you in some ways, because you come from like an improv yeah, sketch comedy background. Definitely. I think, and that was actually getting back to what we were saying before, it's that's definitely my background, going to UCB and Groundlings and all that stuff. So that was easy. The harder part was infusing like real person stuff right. into it. And that is what I learned the most from this. Yeah. Like, once we made it I'm glad like, I can teach you some things. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> bye. Bye. Don't make my arms look fat.
This is a vintage picture of a cookbook from the 50s. It's mm. cake, my Sarah's like cast. surprisingly <laughs> domesticated. Like she loves like crafting and like decorating yes, you do. And I'm stuff. not good at it, but There's I her it. jam box, remember? Oh, that's a cute little place for your jam box. Um, oh, thank you. Um, and this is her cute little bench where we just did the interview. Isn't that sweet? From Home Goods. From it looks Home like Goods. I, custom made it for I this know. Place. These are our blankets that we got from yeah, opening. This is, first date from this is her one and only costume. I'm going to hide the bra. <laughs> it's a size 23. Shut <laughs> up. I'm going to kill you. I'm gonna, and there's her shoes. Old shoes. Those oh, those are the old shoes? Right? Yeah, she yeah. went through some shoe saga. Um, these are cards, right? Yeah, from opening? these are cards from opening. and, uh, and It's then, so clean. It's so, like, I know, I'm really nice. But, uh, so that's episode three. I hope you guys enjoyed watching our cast album and my hilarious interview with Sarah Chase. You can see why um, we enjoy each other so much because she's a hoot. I told you last week it would be a hoot and a half, and um, I was not lying. <laughs> so uh, we're about ready to do our final show of the week. We already did one today. I got my full beat on, and uh, I'm going to re-beat it and <laughs> do one more for the people. Um, so tune in next week. Next week we're going to interview Blake Hammond, um, who you guys saw get the gypped sea robe last week. So um, if you want to tweet me your questions, hashtag kiss and tell, Krista Rudd Gis. I don't know how to say it. Um, <laughs> and you guys have figured it out. So keep tweeting me your questions for Blake. Blake's, you know, you know been in nine Broadway shows, so there's many things he knows questions he could answer um and plays the waiter and among other things in the show so he'll be next so enjoy and um, have a good week guys i'm ready for my first real day off which is tomorrow i can't wait it's gonna be awesome so uh enjoy your day off whenever that is and i'll see you next week bye